beautiful brown baby doll and I am here today to do my first ever what's in my bag. Y'all about to get in a tree for everything I can stuff into a bag. I am always the one with everything. Bella, really you gonna scratch right now? My bag often looks a lot like those that are going to college and going back to school because I'm a professor. I'm on campus all day, I'm moving and shaking. I'm gonna show you just some of the things that I use and some of the things that you might wanna include in your own bag. So the bag that I'm carrying right now is the Big Buddha black bag. Easy to carry, but it's also just big. That's why it's called a Big Buddha. The great thing is that people don't assume that you're carrying a big garbage bag. It still looks stylish and you can carry all your stuff in it and have everything that you need for your day. I love the fact that this bag has zipper pockets that open up to more storage space. So it makes it easier to fit more stuff inside, which is probably bad for me. Then it's also satin lined, so it keeps everything safe and secure. It has small pockets and hidden pockets, and also wonderful detachable straps that are strong. Smooth on one side, textured on the other, so carry it how you like. And I had never even known about a Big Buddha bag until I started going to Ross all the time, which is like my obsession. If I'm able to find it down below, I will have the link for you to use. We gonna get into this Buddha bag because look, I know y'all wondering, what in the world does she have in this bag? First off, it has been from a company called Pure Romance. They actually sponsored this video and are also sponsoring some giveaways on my Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. So be sure to follow me. I'll also put up the instructions on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter to how you can win the giveaways. They will be coming up in the next few weeks and you'll have all the instructions you need for how you can win. I've been carrying around two of their products in particular. The other two are a little too big to fit in my bag. This is the Truly Sexy Flirt. I'm always leery of perfumes. Y'all know I do skin videos all the time and I really don't like stuff on my skin that's gonna irritate it. But this one only has like four or five ingredients. It smells amazing and everybody always asks me what I'm wearing when I whip across campus. There's the Pure Romance Skin Therapy. I also throw this in the bag. I like it because it's quick to spray on and it gives you just a little bit of body mist, a little bit of moisture without making you feel overly oily. You just feel really lightly misted and sexified and moisturized. Now the ones I've also tried that I don't keep in my bag but I do use at home. The Body Dew, Essential Amber and Warm Vanilla and it's Silk Body Oil. This one also has some really good ingredients including sweet almond oil which is good for your skin especially with the change in seasons coming up. Then I also have the Body Boost which is a thick firming cream but I use it just as a lotion. It's really good for lifting and toning and it smooths the skin. I get a lot of dry cracked skin sometimes in weird places especially with this Texas Sun. So I like this one too. I placed the links below to their website just so you can check them out. But remember to be looking out for me on Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter for the contest. Yes! I keep this whole laptop in my bag. It's in a charger bag, which I bought from Amazon. I like this thing because all you gotta do is do like this to charge your computer. <laughs> That's why it's called the charge up bag. And it uncovers and unfolds my wonderful and amazing, beautiful black butterfly girl. I guess is what you call it, or a fairy? I don't know what she is. The big Buddha will hold my computer. Another thing I carry is my iPad. And a lot of my classes, sometimes I have to pull up things. It's in a cute little case that says Akuna Matata because it means no worries for the rest of your day. We all gotta keep cool, calm, and collected. I'm not pulling out my computer all the time, so that's why my iPad gets to travel with me. The other thing I carry with me is a cute little journal book, which I think is one of the cutest things I own. I'm able to easily write down all my appointments, anything I need to remember, anything I wanna think about. I love using my 6S Plus for everything, of course. I really love good old fashioned writing things down. It reminds me to choose to be happy. This one was only like three bucks or four bucks at Ross. I'm gonna place a link below to where you can find similar ones. So that's in my bag. In every classroom across campus, I'm always cold. So I always make room for a little bitty bendable foldable sweater. I enjoy carrying it because I don't care if you're in high school, middle school, college, you know those classrooms are always cold. And nobody's gonna bring you a blanket. This is what I call the holy grail bag. This bag contains 
none other than my life. In this bag, I keep things that my grandma taught me to keep. I do keep a pair of drawers, clean drawers, clean underwear. I think you should always keep a pair of clean underwear. My mama always talks about, so if you get hurt or harmed, if something happens, what people will always remember, the paramedic or whoever come pick you up, is how dirty your drawers look. So I put a clean pair of underwear in my bag. So I have this Echo Tools little book that has little bitty face brushes in it. If I need to touch up, then I have it right here in a little book. I can keep it in there with my other books, my computer, everything, because it's just like a book. In this bag, contains essentials like tissue paper, pads, tampons, feminine wipes and napkins. Facial versions of those by Neutrogena. I love these. I carry a little thing of antibacterial calls cough drops because somebody is forever coughing. I promise you I attract the people that want to cough everywhere. In here I also have aspirin, ibuprofen, and I have gas X. When you eat, sometimes your belly don't agree. And deodorant a little bitty travel size of deodorant because sometimes trekking around campus you might get a little extra moisture under those armpits and we don't want anybody being offended by the moisture that you spread. So I call this my second life. You know how a cat got nine lives? I got two. I also carry a little thing of gel, Eco Styler Olive Oil, a brush for those moments where I need to brush them edges and put a little gel on them. I carry my hair scarf, Visine, just in case my eyes get red, extra pair of contacts, contact solution, and glasses because I am blind as a bat and if something happens to my contacts, I need to be able to see. I also carry a nice pack of gum, Eucerin lotion that I just put into a container because it never fails. I always look down and find a piece of ash. All this in my get my life bag. I have one of my favorite wallets in here. It's by DKNY. A friend of mine actually gave me this. She always gives me cool hand-me-downs. Business card. Also a portable charger and a charger cord. I have a link to this one in the description box. This one is an anchor. I got this one from Amazon for I want to say like 20 bucks, maybe less than that. But I love this thing because you get two full charges on your phone. Favorite lip gloss. I love my EOS. Always cute earring survival kit. Just in case I lose an earring. Secret little stash of cash. I lose cash all the time so I don't carry much. But I carry this around campus because I don't know what I'm going to need it. Headphones. Bobby pins. So if I need to pin my hair up, should it start raining outside? Should something else happen? Or I just want to put my hair up? Cute little pair of sunglasses i probably should retire these two i've thrown them in my bag without a case but they still get the job done in the very front part of my bag i also keep highlighters pencils pens a stylus for my phone and for my ipad i like to keep little bible verses and things that keep me motivated in the front when you're ready to curse somebody out or walk into class become stressful or you have to take a test I like to keep little motivators in my bag and I hide it and sometimes just find it on my own it's also great to just reach in your bag and know where those are and I also keep some blessed tools because the devil will be loose so y'all have seen all of the crazy items I have in my bag. Down below in the description box, you're going to find out more about everything that I had in my bag that I could mention or give you a link to. Well, let me know if you share any of the same items I tend to have, like draws. Check out Pure Romance and I have all their links below and stay tuned on my Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter for the upcoming contest. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Beautiful brown baby doll. Peace. Woo!